Hello, and welcome back to another Pen Talk. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for joining me as I explore the wide world of pens, inks, papers, pen accessories, and maybe a little focus on pen stands, pen holders. And we're going to take a look at these unique, interesting, and very inexpensive cat pen holders that I found on AliExpress. Here's the listing. There are five different versions, and I, of course, got all five. And all five will be going to another home shortly, along with the cat pen. We're going to look at these a little bit more closely. See if there's something that you might find cute, interesting, maybe not as useful as you would like, but not everything that's cute is also useful. So let's take a look at these interesting cat pen stands. So the first thing you may ask is, can it hold up a pen? And the answer is yes. Here it is with a cat pen, which is where you would expect it to work well. And here it is with the Sailor Candy Pen, which certainly fits in well with these cute cats. But does it hold a big pen? Yes, here's the F3, one of the largest pens that I recently added to my collection. And also the Leonardo Mosaico in Blue Hawaii. And here we are with the two Mango Leonardo pens that I have. Yes, these cats can do the duty, but there's a little trick to it. The trick that I used was a little bit of modeling clay at the bottom of the feet to get them to stay and stick to the surface. It worked pretty well. So let's look at these in close up. The designs are painted on. All of these were probably injection molded out of the same mold that used different colored plastic in the mold. You can see that pretty big mold seam there at the butt end. The eyes are done fairly nicely. The ears have a little bit of color in them. And there's a little bit of color in the top of the paws. And the tail has different colored stripes. This is the A cat. And then we'll go to the B cat. Different eyes. A little bit different details. I'm certain there was a mask and it was spray painted on by some machine. And again that same uh, big seam there at the butt end. You could clean that off if you wanted. The head might be a different piece that's glued on there from what I can see in that model. So go, go on to Cat C, the black cat. And again a little bit different color in the eyes in the paws. Now we're going to go on to D, which is the black stripe ones. Another nice set of eyes. Another interesting approach. Same type of stripes that was on the amber. And then the last cat, which is E. Interesting calico type design. Very typical of uh, some cats. And again, some different detailing. Yeah, just nice. End of the tail there has some color to it. So the listing in AliExpress shows the cats in various positions, which I showed in the intro of this video. So I wanted to see if I could balance the cats, and yes, I can. They are fairly light, so you can get the tails and the hands and the feet to kind of coordinate together and build little cat structures from them. So we've reached the end of this video. I hope you found it interesting, amusing. These are very inexpensive, and I think they reflect the fact that uh, it's a low, very low-cost item. They are cute, which is their number one feature. They can hold up a pen if you are careful. It's not like the crabs which can hold up just about any pen, but they're cats and they will be different. 
Do I enjoy these? Yes. Will the owner that receives these for me enjoy them? I think so, but we'll let her decide that. It'll go along with the cat pen. Thank you all for watching. Hope you have a great day. Enjoy your pens. Enjoy your pen accessories. Things that you probably wouldn't have considered if you didn't like your pens and wanted to give them something special occasionally, which I think these cat stands are definitely something special. Hope this video finds you safe, healthy, and happy. Enjoying your life, enjoying the day. We're going to say this is the end. Bye. See you soon.